Hello and welcome to part 16 of Rayman 3 Hoodlum Havoc. Alright guys, welcome back. So here we are, we're on the ship level. We're coming for Andy. Right, this is an interesting level, I have to say, because you have to defend your boat from, like, uh, I don't know, I can't remember the exact name of the enemy, but as you can see, he's over there. Uh, you have, like, some sort of map. There it is. Let's shoot it. And it fires stuff at our boat. Now, you see the yellow health bar at the bottom? That's, um... Not our health bar for the boat. That's what I thought it was originally, but it's not. It's actually the health of the enemies. So we know how well we're doing. Um, while the enemies ain't all coming very fast, I'm going to quickly grab some points. Uh, I don't actually know what they are. They look like freaking sharks or something. Mechanical sharks. In fact, it reminds me of that big mechanical shark out of that old film, James and the Giant Peach. How many of you guys remember that? Looks just like it. Oh, I see, yeah. No, 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 no. Ah, oh, it's a shame I can't knock that back. <laughs> right, um, yeah. The purple pink type dots are where the enemies are coming from, so that gives us a good indication as to where we need to be firing. And there is quite a lot of them coming in now, so it's a good thing that we got them points while we did, because we wouldn't really have a lot of time to do that now. Unfortunately, we have to get this, you know, helicopter fatigue to come back up here to get these ones, which can be a bit annoying. But we have some more coming in this direction. That's oh, kind of hard to go. Yes, it is this way. Good. It's a bit disorientating. Uh, more coming in this way. Go. Damn it, why is there so many mechanical sharks out here? Yeah, this isn't my most favourite level of the game. It, it is kind of difficult. I think the red health bar is out, considering it's going down, and I personally am not taking any damage, but... Um, that health bar is going down, so it has to be damage on the ship. And come to think of it, I don't know if we're going to do it the first time round. I really hope not. I, I really hope that we don't lose. Because our health bar is further down than theirs. And there's more of us than there is them. So I really hope that I don't have to do all of this again. I really don't hope that. Let's just try and get rid of these enemies. This is going to be extremely close, by the way, guys, because their health bar is only just shorter than ours. Oh, jeez. Give me a break. I'll never let go, Jack. One more, one more, one more, one more, one more, one more. Come on. We should do this. Not unless that enemy's got stupidly amounts of damage. But that should be it. Yeah, hey! Oh, you had to get one more last attack in, didn't you? We are the kings of the world. We are the kings of the sea. I feel like Link from Zelda Wind Waker. Ah, we're here. This is an interesting level, I have to say. And again, this isn't one of my most favourite levels either. 60%, not too bad. Um, there must have been more points on the ship then. Oh, huh. that's a shame. Right, yeah, so I can't remember the exact name of this level, but it's all snowy, as you can clearly see. Oh, lovely. Massive amounts of snowballs coming down here. Brilliant. Okay. Oh, and you decide to be there. Okay, right. The summit beyond the clouds here. We're still in this level, which is kind of cool. Um, it would be a bit weird if we finished up that level straight away. Let's get you out of here, first of all, mister. Because we need this red combat fatigue to actually be able to defeat you, so... Let's just charge up, and that should do it. No! Oh, I hate that attack. There we go. Ah, oh, okay. No! This isn't fun. No, 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 no. Okay, stop. I do want to get all the points here without getting hit by snowballs. For crying out loud. No, ah. Oh. Okay. Spider. No, 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 no. Okay. No! 
I swear, I, I think I just went through that. Okay, even if that did happen, that is kind of lucky. Right, so... I'm not a big fan of this level, really. I mean, the Land of the Living Dead, that was one of my most favourite levels. Just because of the atmosphere, um, the scenery, everything basically. Just spot on, really. Um, thanks for turning me into a helicopter spider. <laughs> That's crazy. Like, you actually flatten down with the fatigues as well. Hey, Tinsy! No, 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 okay. Oh man, one out of six. We've got a while until we extend our health bar. You got a lady? Okay. What have you got for me? Ah, yes. My favourite combat fatigue of all time. Right, you need to get out of here. Oh no! Damn it! Okay. Leave me alone. Oh, I did it again. I freaking did it again. Because I'm getting distracted. Okay. Right, now then. Let's try this again. And I want to get all the points because I want the multipliers. Without getting hit. Thank you very much. Okay. And I could use some health, actually. Thanks for giving that to me, game. Because I'm in desperate need of having that right now. <laughs> Um, right, let's take you guys out. Are you guys the ones that can deal th Yeah, you can shoot three fireballs at the same time. That's hardly fair. That's six combined. Oh, camera, turn around. Turn around. I just want to defeat all the hoodlums in Rayman 3. Hoodlum, have a turn around. <laughs> okay. I hate these guys. I don't want to fight these again. I've just fought a thousand mechanical sharks. Do I look like I need this right now? My health definitely suggests that I do not need this. Ah, damn it. This is going to be embarrassing if I get beaten by you guys. There we go, there's one down. It's a good thing the explosion on that doesn't deal damage. Right, so we've got... Ah, leave me alone, please. I did nothing to deserve this. Probably actually one of the hardest common enemies in the game. Just because of how long it takes to beat him. Die already! It's never good when your enemy's health bar is higher than yours. That's never good. There we go. That does deserve a celebratory victory cheer. Right, stock up on health. Definitely stock up on health because I am running seriously low. What do you guys think of the music in this area as well? Do you like it? Because I don't know what to think about it. It's a little bit jolly. I mean, I know it's like <laughs> a Christmassy type level, but I don't know really. I don't know what I think about it. It's nice and peaceful for the scenery of snow. It does feel right to some degree. Oh, I'm freaking hell, man. Okay. Is that it? Is that... Camera, please, stop being a retard. It wasn't it. Okay, right, I'm going to make sure that I've got these before I go up. I mean, I said before, I'm not too concerned about grabbing all of the health... Uh, all of the points, sorry. I could really use some health right now. Um, but if I see them right in front of me like that, I do like to get them. It's like I have missed some secrets during this uh, playthrough of Rayman 3. Um, but I don't think I've ever got every single secret in one playthrough before. That would require a bit of skill, I have to say. But I've really enjoyed this um, game so far. I always do every time I play it, it's got so much classical value. Do you want to build a snowman? No I don't! don't want to build a snowman. That'd be pretty weird. Oh my god, look how many points are inside a snowman for crying out loud. It's a bit much, isn't it? And in this one. <laughs> That's brilliant. Let's try and keep that multiplier going. Right. 
What do we need here? We need that red combat fatigue, don't we? So we need to actually climb up here in order to get it. Because there's a door right in front of us. Plenty of time, bearing in mind. Okay. Ah, the rocket fatigue. I clearly need that right now because of you up there. <laughs> ah, you had to get one more attack in. Why do all the enemies do that in this game? Like, seriously. I just blew a, a fucking snowman's head off with a rocket. <laughs> Finish the job. <laughs> Oh man, how weird would it be if this freaking level was a musical or something, and all of a sudden, like, songs from Frozen started playing. No word of a lie, I'd probably take the CD out and throw it out my window, and then cry because I don't have a copy of Rayman 3 on the PC. Be sad times, I have to say. Can I actually jump up there without those balloons? Yes, I can. I don't even know why the balloons are here. Do I need them for any specific reason? I don't think so. Do I? Oh yeah, I do to be able to get up over there, okay. I managed to get up here though, okay. Ah, yeah, if it broke out into a musical, you know, freaking Rayman started singing Let It Go and stuff like that, I, I wouldn't know what to do, to be honest with you, it'd just be too strange. Rayman isn't the singing type. He's not even really the talking type, to be honest with you. You know, he's not much of a talkative protagonist. Just like Link in a way. Link doesn't say much. And how many of you guys are looking forward to the new Legend of Zelda game coming out? Uh, I don't know exactly when it's coming out, but it looks incredible. And I'm really looking forward to the Star Fox game on the Wii U. Oh, that's going to be so amazing. I would love to... Um, what am I trying to say? I would love to play... Star Fox games on this channel, but again, it's, it's Nintendo, I don't really know what their views are on it. Let's just stomp on him. Um, because I would so play that. I really, really would. You didn't give me any points, how dare you? Ah, uh, it just says Star Fox, Star Fox Wii U. I don't know if Crystal is going to be in it, um, because Crystal is one of my most favourite characters, other than Fox McCloud. Ah, uh, it's going to be such a good game. I wasn't even intending to find that frog, but I did anyway. Okay, I was actually looking at where I'm supposed to be going right now. Um, yeah, I think I'm supposed to go down there. Oh, I did want to fly over there. Never mind, I think we'll be able to get back up there anyway. So, first of all, Mr. Hoodlum with a dollar sign above his head. It's a bit unhealthy. Doesn't that concern you? Shouldn't you go and see your, your doctor about that? <laughs> blah, blah, blah. Right, let's bust open this joint. Proceed, shall we? And this is a really cool combat fatigue. I know I've said this a few times in the past, but it's so easy for breaking open like the piggy banks and that. And just dealing more damage to enemies in general. Right, okay, don't hit me. I'm glad that it didn't hit me because I'm not ready. I'm not ready for this. This is a commitment. Be standing here in front of you all and just taking damage like that. Oh, you can do two at a time, that's pretty cool. Is that another snowman? Yes, it is. I'm sorry, snowman. In fact, I really am sorry. I've just realized that you've got tons of spears going through you. Why are they using snowmen as like target practice? There's a red combat fatigue in here. Holy crap. <laughs> I must need that then, surely. Let's get rid of you. You're just in the way. A yellow combat fatigue. Do I need to fly? Apparently so. I don't remember that much about this level, unfortunately. I mean, like I said, it's not one of my most favourite levels, so therefore I didn't really enjoy it as much when I played it before, so I don't really remember that much about it. The specific parts here in the game, like, as I said, the land of the living dead, um, things like that are actually really memorable for me. If you've played this game as well, what's your most memorable moment? Is it similar to me? Is it um, different to me? I'm curious to know. Tinsy! I will save you, Tinsy. I'm just going to kick this hoodlum in the face for all of his bad doings. <laughs> Sometimes it's easier just to do that. Yes, I will help you. 
why don't the Tinsies sound very scared or whatever when you when they're asking for help? They're just like, help. They don't sound that desperate. Perhaps I'll just leave him. <laughs> I'm not going to, of course. I think I actually need to rescue him. Ba -ba -da -ba. Don't know what he said. Um, right, this is blue combat fatigue. Oh, I know why I need this. Yes, we need to go back now. Yeah, why were they abusing snowmen? That seems just so immoral. I mean, all this snow is around and you can have so much fun providing you don't pee in it and then drink it. I've never done that and I'm glad I haven't done that because that would be very, very gross. Um, but you can have so much fun with snow. What are they, what are they doing throwing spears at snowmen? Oh, I'm going to have to come back up here again. I can't get up there that way. Okay, that's fine. We should better do this easy enough. What the hell was that? Did somebody just get punched in the face? <laughs> oh, it's you. Oh, that's right. They bring another enemy back here. And you'll see why, actually, when I kill him. Because... It should give us a blue combat fatigue. There it is. How, see, this is what I'm talking about. The amount of generosity this in this game. They give you more combat fatigue so you don't have to go back again. This is exactly what I said before in my last episode. The game is very generous with things. It gives you plenty of health, plenty of points, plenty of combat fatigues. It's just, it's generous. I've, I've never known a game to be so generous. And there we go. We've done it. And I just remembered... Well, it's too late now, but... I think there was a secret back there. I can't remember, though. Never mind, we didn't do too bad. We got 61%. That's actually pretty good. That is actually pretty good. Alright. Hey. You sound rather animated, throwing your boxing gloves at me. You need to get out of here, Mr. Voodoo Man. I will not have it. Seriously. Okay. Let's get rid of you. <laughs> I, don't, I don't know why, that noise is just hilarious for some reason. Um, there's a Tinsy over there, let's grab the Tinsy quickly. I don't want to attack Help. you, Piggy. One. Okay, four. It's getting better. What about you? Very generous, okay. <laughs> Are you serious? Oh, give me a break, really? You're guarding a freaking Tinsy. How pathetic are you? Got nothing better to do than that? One gem, okay. <laughs> um, thank you, thank you very much, okay. This is where I'm probably going to be leaving this episode of Rain Man, so hopefully you guys are enjoying Rain Man 3, and you'll join me for the next episode. Alright guys, so thanks for watching, and I'll see you all next time. Take care. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, what, what the hell, jumping straight into this I see, freaking hell, where is he, there's a zombie in this room, where is he, ah! <laughs> um, oh crap, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, what do I do, there's a lamp, Pick up the lamp and throw it at his head or something. Do anything. Anything in your power. Or else you'll be eaten. But there's a small medical kit. Thanks for the heads up. I'm probably going to need it now.